Good morning, grandkids. Well, we are back with Jari and Aniko. Well, dear Anigo, we have finished our trek all around the mountains, and uh, let's go up here on this rock and see if we can't take, I still don't know who that guy is, and let's see if we can take uh, another look out over my very favorite, favorite place. Look out there. Isn't that all the North Sea where we went all the way around the coast? It is, isn't it? That was my very favorite, favorite journey that we made was all around the North Coast. That was such a cool place. But now, I'm kind of hankering for some green trees and cool forests. Um, we got a lot of stuff on us, but we have so much stuff at home that I don't feel like we really need to save a bunch of what we have. Let's, let's go to White Run and just sell off everything that we're carrying that we don't need. And then go home and change our clothes into our leathers and go down around Fall Creek to the forest. Shall we do that? I, yeah, I'm, I'm just really looking forward to the cool green forest. Let's go, let's fast travel to White Run. See where we were at? We had come all the way around the coast as far as here. Now we've come all the way around the mountains as far as here. So we are done with that. We've done a little bit of this area. We've done the rift. Maybe someday we'll do this area. I don't know. I really would like to do this too sometime. Oh, where am I at? Oh, here. Let's go to White Run. Sip me some morning coffee. I forgot what game I was playing. I'm back and forth in so many games that I forget what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> I wasn't supposed to have the webcam with Jury and Anigo, but here I am. So I guess I'll do tomorrow's this way too. Oh, it's night time. It's always night time when I get somewhere. Let's try eight hours. I don't want way up in the morning because we got things to do and places to go. Are they open? No. I wish people would get to work at a decent time. It's almost eight o'clock. Give you two more hours. Did you just jump an ego? Did I startle you? I love the way you look at me. All right, let's see if they're open now. They are. Got something for just about everybody in here. Well, Give I have something for have you. Questions. Welcome to War Maidens. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. All right, let's see what I can get rid of. I'm saving that. I don't need to save that. Why is, oh, it's showing that it's enchanted. Okay, okay, I thought it was showing it was in my, oh, that's his anyway. God, girl, pay attention. You're not, you're gonna do something wrong. Got lots of arrows, my goodness. Look at how many arrows I've got. Wow, I can kill people and animals for days. All right, tell this. You know what, Anigo? 
I really need to practice with my two scimitars because they're both enchanted and they are so cool and I really, really would love to learn how to use them. I need to practice. Remind me of that while we're in, in the Falkreath area. I've got that steel dagger up to exquisite. Why don't I have anything else? Oh, because I can't upgrade enchanted stuff yet. I got that. Well, that's all I can sell then. Okay, let's look at my armor. Yeah, I'll get rid of this crap. Okay, what else will you take off my hands? I guess we better drop that stuff at home. I don't think I need any more leathers. Well, that's only one. I could work that up while we're at home. Okay, let's go see what the traders Good got. Business with you. I could have looked to see if he had any lockpicks. I forgot to look to see how many I had. We should live here in town, back there in that house. But I don't want to buy it. Look at all the people around. What are you doing here, kid? Go home. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. See me drinking my coffee? Let me know. I might have it stored away. Once again, somebody the other day asked me, or told me, how to mine properly. <laughs> I had to explain to them, once again, that it's my game and I'll play it however I want to, and they can play theirs. And uh, Please do look I like to mine the sure way I mine because it gives me an opportunity to sip my coffee. What about? As if it was well, their business. Listen, Braith. All right. Talk to your mother about this, okay? Enough belly aching. Everything's for sale, my friend. Yep, yep. Everything. I wish I could buy, buy all that stuff. Sell her in a second. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Okay, what can I sell you? Oh, I don't have anything left of these, do I? Oh, yes, I do. I'm not selling any of this stuff. You can have this and this. Ah, uh, what's this? Oh, I'm wearing that. Okay. Now, let me see. You can have this. This and this. Ice and Chitin? What kind of a book is that? Have I read that? I don't know. We need to drop them off at home. I probably need to eat some of this. I like that. I never use that. Scroll of Harmony. I'm not a thief. I don't need to sneak up on people and keep them calm while I kill them or something. Look at how much money that's worth. Look at how much money I got. My goodness. Aniko, we need to buy something. Good. We could buy that house in... In... We could buy that house just down the street. No problem. But we got such a big, beautiful home. We don't need it. I got more room there than I know what to do with. <sighs> Let's sell these. Scroll of Mass Paralysis, that's a good one. We might meet a boss that I need to use that on, if I ever think of it. Put that on. Oh my god. Sorry. Uh, I need to put that on my hot bar. Look at all this stuff. I never use that. We never use that. 
I never use that. I got a lot of good potions, though, that I use any one of. I wish I had a bunch of these vigorous. But when you go to buy them, they're expensive. And I never have the stuff to make them. Okay, we'll keep all that. Alright, let's go home and uh, do something. Do come back. But... And you go. What are we going to do with all this money we've got? is a that is something to think about I just don't know all right let's go home the only good thing about loading screens is coffee I really don't think this is the door I want to go into right now. This is the living room area. I don't know if I have a chest in there or not. I think I do. Yeah, I do. Let me give you some room. That's okay. Oh my goodness, that chest has gobs of stuff in it. If we sold all this junk. We'd have even so much more money. Oh my word. My word. I didn't know all that was in there. Alright. Let's uh, go to the door I wanted to come in at. Look at my weapons I've got up here saving. What have I got? There's an Orcish Greatsword. It's just so cool looking. The Axe of White Run. Oh, Bolar's Oath Blade. Look at how much value that has. <laughs> but it's just such a cool sword, I gotta keep it. There's a Falmer Sword. I just think they look cool. What's that? Orkish War Axe. I like the way it looks too. And here's some different armor sets that I have. Look. I thought that was really cool. And I got some fur armor. I got one of the Imperials armor. Let's see if I got something on me that I can dress. I should go upstairs and get some of that stuff out of that chest. I don't have anything in these chests. Alright, let's go in here and get rid of some of this ore and stuff. Down there is where I want to go. Look at this chest. Nothing in it. Nothing in it. If I kept everything and filled all these chests, I wouldn't have any money. I just have stuff. <laughs> and there's where we make our uh, mead and stuff. All right, let's uh, see what we got going on here. We'll get a blessing while we're home before we start out. Make sure all of our diseases are healed. All right. There, we have one. And up here.
We have 113 lock picks. That's pretty good. Alright, is there anything that I could do? Uh, I don't want to create anything. I wish I could double enchant. Look, see, I can't do anything because everything's... Oh, God. I gotta work on my enchanting skills when I level up. And, uh... See if I can't get that perk. Choose an item to... I can't even improve anything. I guess I don't have anything on me to improve except my mofu mofu stuff. I'm getting ready to take that off. Alright, my dear Anigo, let's go upstairs. Or, right, let's go to the door that... I don't need to go upstairs to the bedroom. Let's go out here. I think this is where we have our stuff to change into. Yep. Leather armor. Superior. Do you still have your leather boots on, Anigo? Or do you wear those? Well, here, I'm going to put, I'm going to change clothes right now. I'm keeping my out gear hood. Keeping all that. I'm storing my boots, my coat, my mittens. Did I put something in there? I didn't mean to. I went by that awful fast. Alright, I'm putting this on, and I'm taking yours, and I'm taking the leather boots superior, and I'm taking the hide boots muffled for you, the hide bracers bows one damage, and the hide superior bracers bows three damage. All right, I think that's all I need off of there. Let me put one of these on. And muffled moves silently. Muffled moves silently. Okay, I want these. You can have, you can wear the other pair. And I want these bracers. You can wear the other bracers. Alright. My man. My man. Give me what talk? you got on. Get naked. Anything new? No. All right. Look at you. just so handsome. No matter what you put on, you're just a handsome feller. Okay, I gotta put your stuff in the, in the trunk.
Oh, I gotta get rid of our ingredients first, Inigo. Oh, and I don't think... I don't think... I sold off a... Did I sell a bunch of the potions or not? If not, I'll put them in here. Uh, but right now, let's get rid of all the ingredients that we've got. I probably should make some, but I don't want to take time. I'm so anxious to get to the woods. Got ingredients in it too. Um. Thank you, Talos. I don't use that. I should give that to. I should give that. Oh, that's what's in the chest. Goodness sake. Those are filled. I should put these filled ones in here because I'm not going to be doing anything away from home. Store. Over. I need to put something cool in here. I don't have anything left on me. I don't think. Nope. That exquisite dagger in there, but that don't look like anything. <laughs> Do I have any books I should store? Uh, let's see. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. That. I should store that and store that. Oh, it's a quest item. Never mind. I didn't know that. That's a quest item. Oh, jeez. Why am I not questing on it? Well, because I don't like to go on quests. Where's my Anigo? There you are, my pumpkin. All right, shall we go? I'm ready. Oh, that's your bedroom. This is just such a beautiful home in Eagle. I'm so glad we live here. Say goodbye for a while to our cute little patio area out there. Say goodbye to our sauna and our hot tub. A little garden going around there of all of our ingredients. Up I there to the other entrance of our house. Too much school my back in the day. Forgive me if I sometimes repeat myself. I still can't hardly hear you and I have worked on the sound in the computer and I just looked at it as the game came on and before it started running in this here 
and uh, the PC sound was up to 100, so I don't know why I can't hear him. My in-game voices are up to 100. See? So I don't know what else to do. There isn't anything else making a lot of loud noise to cover him up, so I don't know what else to do. I don't know what happened. I used to be able to hear him just fine. Okay. Let's oh, let's get out of here. Shall we depart? We want to go through this this forest area. Starts way back in here. We might come back eventually and go up through there. But right now I want to follow that main road away from Falkreath and uh, just go off to the sides here and there and see what we see. Oh, there's the Khajiits going to elsewhere. And no, Anigo, you can't go. Alright, which direction are we going out of Falkry? That's right. Okay. I don't want to go at night time. Enemies? What enemies? Do we hear any enemies? Oh! Oh, for crying out loud. What is it? Oh, it's a dragon. Whoa, mister. Holy catfish. He landed right in front of my face. Uh, let's, uh, ooh, let's see if we can paralyze him. And then shoot him. Don't accidentally hit an ego. We gotta go back in here. He's really upset. There he goes! And, and there another dragon bites the dust. Let me through guys, let me through. I never would have believed it if I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. You are a very Interesting individual. Really Who are you though? talking to, Anigo? Me or them? Or the dragon? You know that I can kill dragons. What do you mean you think I'm an interesting individual? Oh, here we go with the bones and scales again. Now we're going to have to wait until daylight and sell them. Oh, we got some dwarven arrows. And an ebony arrow. That's yours. And a steel arrow. What arrows am I using? Oh, was once full of wanderers and warriors. My dwarven arrows. I got 101 of those and they're my best ones. No, the elven arrows are my best one. Oh, those are lousy, and I got a bunch of them. That oh, look how many I've got of the iron. They're worthless. Oh my gosh. I probably out in the wild should be using my steel arrows instead of all my good ones. You think? I think. 
They kill wolves and stuff just as well as the others. I don't want to use up my good ones on stuff out in the wild. Yourself. Those were better days. Well, can we get on the road now? Come on, Inigo. We shall leave them standing there to their amazement. And we shall leave you standing there to your never knowing what's going on with me. <laughs> well, now that Khajiit's going into town to see what all the ruckus was about. All right, let's change this to daytime. Sometimes that cursor just will not grab onto that. How about six, seven, eight hours? See what happens. See what it looks like. Maybe we could take a trip to elsewhere, Jerry. We might. We might take a vacation there someday before we go uh, up to those mud flats or something. Not the mud flats, the swamp. I do want to go through the swamp. I don't think we've toured the swamp. We might have gotten into it a little bit when we was going around the North Shore, but I don't remember. This is a beautiful place, Inigo. Shall I be picking ingredients? Or just enjoying the view? Look at this. If you would ever be turned around the right direction, I'd be happy. Turn around! Thank you. Now let's see if we can't get a couple's picture. Thank you, my dear. I like it when you pose for me. Well, you know I'm going to have to go off trail and wander around in some of this. Probably right back to town, but let's go up and see. Oh, there's that Kashyyyk's cart that they take to elsewhere. And there's town. I knew it went right back to town. You can't catch me, Anigo. Look at the beautiful woods.
Shall we climb? Or try to. It's probably going to get too steep and not let us. It's so beautiful, Inigo. Ooh, where's this going? Let's let's go to the left and go out through here. It's pointing me toward that. I don't want to go there. Let's crop through here. Oh. There's one of those places. I don't want to go inside anywhere yet. No matter what we find. Where you at? Where'd you go? <laughs> Sorry. No matter what we find, no matter what I say, don't let me go inside anywhere. Okay? Roadside ruins. <laughs> Roadside ruins. Oh, there's a chest down there, Anigo. <gasps> but there's a spriggan guarding it. Forget that mess. Will she come up out of there if I shoot her with a bow? Let's see. Nature has claimed this place. Yes, it has. Be do be do be do. Her backs to me. Angry plant. Ah. Oh no. Oh she. <laughs> she did come out. I think. Ah, Anigo, don't die in there, please. Oh, you got it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. I think those things are so cool, but I just hate to fight them. Now, what way was we going? North. Oh, what's over this hill? Look at all the trees. <gasps> oh my gosh, this place is just so beautiful. I love it. Listen to that music. Oh my gosh. Anigo. You hear the magic in the air? Do you hear it? We stand at the start of a new day. Uh -huh. I hope it treats us well. It will, Inigo. It is a new day. A new area. And we are refreshed and ready to go. I'm even liking you wearing our leathers for a change, aren't you? It's nice to get out of those hot mufu mufu coats. Why is there a patch of dirt right there? Just the side of the hill, I guess. Uh oh. 
Oh, I guess I better be carrying this. These things sneak, sneak up on me too close, and I can't get my bow out fast enough, and then they're right in my face. And so, I better carry this up all the time instead of my bow. I'm not sneaking up on anything. Ah! Oh, I thought that was a bear. <laughs> Sorry. Uh-oh. I'll help you out, Anigo. Alright. Now. Search Orc. Why did he attack us? He's not a bandit. We haven't done anything to the orcs. Why did he attack us? Orcish gauntlets, look at that. They aren't enchanted or anything, but look how much they're worth. And they're not very much weight. I want to take those. Where did he come from? Up there. Well, we weren't doing anything to you, sir. Let's look on the map where we're at. All right, let's go to our left. Listen to the birds. Whoop. Oh, we're right back at that place. We don't want to do that. Oh, no. Do I hear a bear? I did, but I guess we're leaving it, I hope. If I heard a bear, maybe I should change to my bow. There he is. Oh, let's get up on here. Maybe he won't know we're there. He can climb up here easy. Where is he? Go.
Oh, you got him. Thank you, dear. You are the hunter after all. Uh-oh, I think there's another one. Oh, it's a spriggan. And it dodges everything. Oh, you are good, my man. Are they going to be all over the place out here? Looks like it, doesn't it? What's this? What is this? This, this is rather lovely. It is, but it's strange. Evergreen Grove discovered. Oh, that's where these spriggans are coming from. Are there any more around? I want to investigate this. Hopefully there's only those two. Look, the stones are... Well, they're not sunken. The pool of water has filled up. Look at that sacrificial table out there. And there's a body on it. Can I get to it? Look at you splashing about. Splashing about. I'm not just splashing about, I'm investigating. He's an alchemist. We'll take that Nern root. Oh, and the vampire dust. But what's going on with this? There's nothing down there that I can see. There's a book just laying on the ground. Manamarco, King of Worms. What is that about? A sacred isle, or Teum. Where rosy light infuses air, o'er towers and through flowers, gentle breezes flow, softly sloping green kissed cliffs to crashing foam below. Always springtide afternoon housed within its border, this mystic mist protected home of the Sigic Order, those counselors of kings, cautious wise and fair ten score years and thirty since the mighty raymond's fell two brilliant students studied within the sissics physic sigic's fold one's heart was light and warm the other dark and cold the matter ladder manny marco whirled in a deathly dance, his soul in bones and worms, the way of the necromance. Entrapping and enslaving souls, he cast a wicked spell. The former, Galarian, had magic bold and bright as day. He confronted Manimarco beneath gray Sephora Tower, saying, your wicked mysticism is no way to weld your power, bringing horror to the spirit world, your studies must cease. Manny Marco scoffed, hating well the ways of life and peace. 
and return to his dark artistry, his paints, death, and decay. O oh, sacred isle, Arteum, how slow to perceive the threat when the ghastly truth revealed how weak the punishment. The Gaulish Manamarco from the Isle of the Wise was sent. To the mainland, dawn's beauty, more death and souls to reap. You have found a wolf and sent the beast to flocks of sheep. Galerian told his masters a terror on Tamriel has set. Speak no more of him, the sage cloaks of gray did say. T'was not the first time Galerian thought his masters callous, unconcerned for men and mere, aloof in their island palace. T'was not the first time Galerian thought t'was time to build a new order to bring true magic to all, a mighty mage's skill. But t'was the time he had left at last, fair atrium's azure bay. But t'was the time he left at last, fair Arteum's azure bay. Oh, but sung we have a Vanus Galarian many times before. How cast he off the Sigix chains, bringing magic to the land. Throughout the years, he saw the touch of Manamarco's hand through Tamriel's deserts, forests, towns, mountains, and seas. The dark grip stretching out, growing like some dread disease. But his dark necromancers collecting, oh, by, and by his dark necromancers collecting cursed artifacts of yore. They brought to him these tools, mad wizards and witches, and brought blood-tainted herbs and oils to his cave of sin, sweet akaviri poison, dust from saints, sheaves of human skin, toadstools, roots, and much more cluttered his alchemical shelf. Like a spider in his web, he sucked all their power into himself. Manamarco, worm king, world's first of the undying liches. Corruption on corruption, till the rot sunk to his very core. Though he kept the name Manamarco, his body and his mind were but a living, moving corpse as he left humanity behind. The blood in his veins became instead a poison acid stew. His power and his life increased as he fell collection grew. Mightiest were these artifacts long cursed since days of yore. They say Galarian left the guild, calling it of Morass, but untruth is a powerful stream, polluting the river of time. Galarian beheld Manamarco's rise through powers sublime. To his mages and lamp nights, before my last breath, face I must the tyranny of worms and kill at last on death. He led them north to cursed lands to a mountain pass. Oh, those who survived the battle say its like was never seen. Armored with magicka, armed with an sorcelled sword and axe, Galarian cried, echoing, Worm King, surrender your artifacts and their power to me, and you shall live as befits the dead. A hollow laugh answered, You die first, Manamarco said. The mage army then clashed with the unholy force obscene. Imagine waves of fire and frost and the mountain shivers, picture lightning arcing forth, crackling in a dragon's sigh. Like leaves, the battle mages fly to rain down from the sky at the necromancer's call, corpses burst from earth to fight, to be shattered into nothingness with a flood of holy light, a maelstrom of energy unleashed, blood cascades and rivers, like a thunderburst in blue skies or a lion's sudden roar, like sharp razors tearing 
over delicate embroidered lace. So at a touch did Galarian shake the mountain to its base. The deathly horde fell fatally, but heeding their dying cries from the depths, the thing they called Worm King did rise. Nern itself did scream in the mages and necromancers war. His eyes burning dark fire, he opened his toothless mouth, vomiting darkness with each exhalation of his breath, all sucking in the fetid air, felt the icy touch of death. In the skies above the mountain, darkness overcame pale. Then Manamarco, Worm King, felt his dismal powers fail. The artifacts of death pulled from his putrid skeletal claw. A thousand good and evil perished then, history confirms. Among, alas, Vanus Galarian, he who showed the way. It seemed once that Manamarco had truly died that day. Scattered seemed the necromancers, wicked, ghastly fools, back to the mages' guild. Victors kept the cursed tools of him, living still in undeath, Manamarco, king of worms. Children, listen as the shadows cross your sleeping hutch, and the village sleeps away, streets emptied of the crowds, and the moons do balefully glare through the nightly clouds, and the graveyards people rest, we hope, in eternal sleep. Listen, and you'll hear the whispered tap of the footsteps creep. Then pray that you'll never feel the Worm King's awful touch. My God, that was a good book. Um, I'm sorry if I took too long with this video reading that, but that was great. I loved it. I'm keeping that. All right. Well, I think I better end this. Where's my amigo? There you are, dear. Did you like that? Did you like me reading to you for a change instead of you always reading to me? Oh, let me see here. I want to get us a nice picture here. All right. All right, I'm going to save it right here. I hope any Spriggans don't attach me, attack me <laughs> while I'm gone. And I, I'm going to end this, and I'll see you in the next video. Sorry this one is so long, but I really enjoyed that. Goodbye.